good friend. Stop it. What yeah. a beautiful seat. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, yeah. Look at this, like, jump at you. Yeah, I've never had a burger here. Yeah, it's a beef burger. Like an animal? Yeah, that's it. Now we leave now. Well, I um, didn't film an outro yesterday because we had a little bit of an experience after the restaurant. So when we came out, we were driving my husband's Suburban. It's an older vehicle. It's a 1999 Chevy Suburban. And um, I forgot to turn the lights off on the vehicle because it's not like my car. When I get out of my car, it lets me know if I need to shut anything off or close any doors or yada, yada, yada. So his truck does not do that. And I left the lights on and when we came back from um, the restaurant and the day at the park, I found that the battery was dead. So we got to try an experience at Disney and see what it was like um, when they come by and help you. So what happened was my son actually ran back to the tram and asked them, you know, what do we do in this situation? And the lady on the tram called it in to the security people and they came, they were there within 20 minutes. They had all the stuff that they needed, um, a little battery cable, a jumper set, 
it was very fast, very easy. He popped it on, we waited two minutes, and the big truck started right up. So they have the equipment to start your vehicle, no matter what size. He also stated that if it didn't start, that they do have tow trucks on property that will come and jump it for you as well. So that was another option. It was a very easy process. We thought we were gonna be sitting there for hours and it was not the case. We were there for maybe 30 minutes. So I kind of wanted to go over that in the video with you about the situation, just in case it ever happens to you. It could be your rental car, it could be your regular vehicle. Just know that if something like that does happen, Disney does help you free of charge. So I just wanted to go over that with you. Now I do want to talk about the restaurant. Um, <laughs> when we got there, um, I messed up and I accidentally put, because we spent the day at Disney's Animal Kingdom and I'm sure that you're going to see that video if you haven't seen it yet. But we spent the day at Disney's Animal Kingdom so I knew we were going to be there so I had planned on setting um, a reservation time for Rainforest Cafe. I set the time, you know, accordingly to when we would be done with the park to be able to eat. We got to the Rainforest Cafe at our designated time slot, which was 1.30. We got there about 1.05, 1.10 so that we could check in and everything would be fine. And I'm glad that we did. We got there and I showed the lady my time slot and she goes I'm not finding you in the system are you sure it's not under your maiden name or something like that I said no but I gave her my maiden name just in case she looked and she's like no I don't see it so I showed it to her on my phone and she goes oh you made this for Disney Springs and I went oh no is that going to be an issue do I have to go all the way over there and she goes no 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 she goes I'm going to call Disney Springs right now and cancel that for you and we'll get you right in and I was like wow that's awesome. So she says, you know, just go either wait in the gift shop or wait at the bench and we'll let you know when your table's called. We went and sat down. It wasn't five minutes and they had called us up to our table and we were sitting down. And we had the most beautiful spot. We were next to the little waterfall area and the little monkeys and the gorillas. They were like, you know, doing their thing every few minutes. It was such a nice spot to sit so we order our food um, the waitress came over you know did her thing we order our food and after we ordered our food we didn't see our waitress for about 30 minutes um, her section was right there but we didn't even see her because there was nobody sitting around us so we were her only table we didn't see her for about 30 minutes finally our food you know came you know, she sat down. Now, I will say our food was amazing. Everything that we ordered. I mean, my son was a little picky about how, cook, how cooked his was, but it was still good. It had nothing to do with the, the quality of the food and how wonderful it tasted. We had an amazing experience when it came to the food. But again, she didn't come check on us. She didn't ask us if we needed more drinks. Um, their drinks were empty they didn't say nothing and she had no tables no tables so we were her only table and I think maybe she had one other one that was already done because I could have swore I saw her bring the check over to them so they were already done and so she had so she only had us to take care of um, she finally uh, my husband finally flagged down another waitress and as he flagged down another waitress she finally walked over and he was like you know do you mind if I get some more to drink and she was like yeah no problem again we didn't see her again for another 30 minutes so I don't know if she had like side chores she was doing or I'm not really sure I know that that was a long period of time in between each time she came to us to check on us and um, when she was standing with us, I felt like she didn't want to be there. She she had, she had just had this little attitude on her that she, I don't know, she had had a long day and she was ready to go. And I can understand that completely. I work for a living myself. But 
she definitely felt like she was ready to go home and she did not want to be there. All I'm saying is that when you're paying Disney money for a restaurant, you know, you, you want to have some sort of experience. Um, I understand that the ambiance is most of the experience at Rainforest Cafe, but you're doing your job and so you should do your job. <laughs> So whenever you get your check, just make sure you go over it. If you are an annual pass holder, just let them know again um, that you're an annual pass holder because I did get 10% off for that. So just go over that with them. Um, we were going to get the volcano um, dessert, but because of everything that happened, we did not end up doing that. It was just like, we, we were just ready to go. We were just ready to leave. We, we got left hanging so many times just sitting there that it was like we were just ready we had spent a long day at the park and it just wasn't it wasn't a great experience and I do want to add that that was not my first time there that was my third or fourth time there and we have never had an experience like that every single time that we have gone it was amazing um, we always had a, a pretty good seat and um, the experience, the waiter and waitresses were always so, so great. This time it, it was not, it just was not. And I know you're gonna have that every once in a while. It just, if that was a family ending their Disney vacation, I would hate for that to be the last taste in their mouth. For me, I'm an annual pass holder. I come as much as I want, you know, I, I can make another reservation and redeem myself, you know, being at Rainforest Cafe, but for some families, they save up their money for months at a time, a year at a time to take their family to Disney. And if they made that reservation, that's the experience that they got. I, I would feel so bad for them because it was, it was just not right. It really wasn't right. But again, the food was great. But that is gonna be it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you enjoyed the video, hit the like button. If you're new to the channel, please subscribe. And until next time, see ya.